Our electron scavenging plasmoid drive creates holographic zero matter, which is to say it generates all frequencies, therefore it emits direct current, which is no frequency. This represents the 360 degree, zero degree paradigm. This drive is based on the framework of our model of the elements and is achieved by placing three-part copper coils at the elemental nodal positions and passing neodymium magnets through each coil's aperture in sequential progression. The resulting pulses release electrons, which are harvested using our plasmoid medium. This is both a mechanical drive and an electron scavenger. The individual frequencies are a consequence of the magnet's fixed rate of progression over an expanding distance. The electromagnetic pulsing through the coils, with a differentially expanding spacing determined by phi on our plasmoid pi surface between the coil's elemental locations, generates all the elemental frequencies and therefore combine to produce none, again the 360 degree zero degree paradigm. The zero point monopolar collision created by our implosive vortex waveguide causes opposite spirals to collide in quadrature and in sequence, therefore maintaining a large zero point center and 16 peripheral zero points at the implosive vortex waveguide's equatorial plane. This enables the zero matter plane to be tapped and therefore harnessed as an energy source. The purpose of the scavenger unit is to facilitate a closed feedback loop. By harvesting the free electrons and recirculating both the DC and AC charge, this sustains the discharge in quadrature required by the implosive vortex waveguide turbine, enabling the engine's operation in both submarine and space environments.